Here's how to install Call of Duty Mobile on your PC. If this video helps you, all I ask in return is that you subscribe. Let's go! Now, the first step to get Call of Duty Mobile on our computer is to download Gameloop. Gameloop is the official emulator for Windows where you will be able to play Call of Duty. For that, click on the first link in the description. We'll put you in this article. This is an in-depth article in case this video is too fast for you guys because I do know that I speak a bit fast. So if you get lost, you could come back to this article. But if you want to go straight to the point, just come down to step one and click on download. That will redirect you to the game loop site. You could also look this site up yourself and then hit download over here on the top right corner. And the download for the game loop installer will begin right away. Once you've downloaded that file, I want you to go ahead and drag and drop it into your desktop. You can find that file here on your recent download history or within the downloads folder of your computer. Now, with this file in our desktop, let's go ahead and double click on it. It will most likely prompt you with an administrator sign. Just go ahead and allow it to run. And then you'll be over here where we're going to hit install. And now we just have to wait for game loop to install. Now, once game loop installs, let's go ahead and open it. I always disable the shortcuts feel free to keep it on but i always disable it and now just go ahead and hit a start now once the game opens usually we'll have call of duty mobile right here but if you don't see it right here as the first option you could just search for it on the top just search up call of duty and then hit enter and you'll see call of duty mobile right here and just go ahead and hit install and while you wait for your game to install you could come back here to your desktop and delete the game loop installer because we're not going to be using that anymore now you just have to be patient guys the installation process might be longer for some of you let's just go ahead and wait now guys usually after the game finishes installing it will open by itself but if it doesn't you could go over to your library and you will see call of duty mobile in here and you could press open now once the game opens go ahead and hit on play now and then it will give you a little walkthrough of how to play the game using the emulator on the pc now we have to wait for call of duty to download all the resources that it needs and trust me this is barely the tip of the iceberg it's going to keep downloading a lot of things it needs to download all the maps all the skins all the weapons all of that so we need to be very patient before playing online now guys if you get this prompt in here just choose the option that suits your computer the best i'm gonna choose low resolution Solution because this computer I'm using is not the greatest but if you have a great computer you can choose HD resources I'm gonna choose low resolution and then go ahead and hit okay once you're set and like I said just wait for Call of Duty to download everything it needs now if you guys get this prompt in here you're free to read through that and then go ahead and hit accept if you accept and here is a very important part guys I recommend that you log in with a Call of Duty account or some account that you have access to because if you play as a guest you won't be able to carry over your progress and if you ever delete game loop or if you ever have to play the game on some other platform you won't be able to get access access to your account so always use an account that you have access to now once you log in you go through here and if you just created a new account you're gonna have to go through a little tutorial which i recommend doing and not skipping but i already have an account and i have already played this game a lot so i don't have to go through any tutorials now guys once you're in the game i recommend playing around with the settings since you're playing on a computer you want to go through everything in here you want to familiarize yourself with what you're doing there's a couple custom things that you want to change around in here and let me know down in the comments if you like a whole video on how to get the proper settings for call of duty mobile on pc so you could get the best out of the game now something i could tell you in this video though is that if you go over to your graphics down here you could lower that graphic quality if you're struggling when playing this game if you're very laggy you could always lower the graphics quality in here put it on something like low or medium or whatever you guys prefer and guys before we go a little tip is that if you come over to the game loop app i want you to go over to your settings right here on the top go ahead and open the settings and something i recommend doing is under the basic checking off the auto run at a startup you only want to open game loop when you want and not when the computer turns off so just go ahead and check that off and hit save and then you could also change the settings in here on engine to get more out of your games now, if you guys would like a video on this as well let me know down in the comments and that's something that we could definitely work on as well but anyways guys that is how to get call of duty mobile on your computer in 2025 if this video helped you out don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys next time